Hello YouTube, this is all Southern Pride Gaming. I am Home Run and I'm gonna today I'm gonna to teach you how to use your DS action replay for DSI without your without a CD if you've lost your CD or like me you just bought it and yours doesn't come with it. First thing you want to download is this from the action from Code Junkies. I'll, I'll put links in the description. But you want to download this from Code Junkies. It is the uh, the what you want to call it. It's the pretty much the CD. It's pretty much whatever the CD does is in there. Okay, but if you launch your action replay, oh no, waiting for action replay card. This will never quit. So what you need to do is if you don't have the CD, you need to go into your device manager. Do this by going here. Device. Just type in DEVI and then go to the device manager. And you'll see sometimes it'll come up to unknown devices, but it's right here. That's because, well, I'll show you. You can update your driver software, browse, do this if it's unknown. If it's an unknown, like, it'll say unknown right about here. Unknown system. Then you right click, update driver, then you browse your computer, let you pick from a select list, and then you put have disk. Now you want to go to browse, and you usually want to have it on your desktop, so let's see, you just go to desktop, I have it on my desktop, and this is for 32-bit windows, and this is for 64, so you want to do 64. You want to click OK. And next. Now this may work for some people but it may not work for others. I don't know why it worked for some and doesn't work for others but this is the error that you find. It says code 52 blah 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 blah. Pretty much you don't have a digital code like a CD has so Windows doesn't know if you pirated it. This is the new latest version of Windows like stopping pirating I guess. What you want to do is you want to use this program called Device Signature Enforcement And then you want to go to sign a system file. Now what you want to do is you want to open up your DSI thing and go to your system, whatever you want, the system property thing. And then you want to do properties. You want to go security. You want to copy the object name and paste it, cancel, exit out of that, and then paste it right here. You want to go OK. Well, when they should pop up, and it says restart your computer, and then you want to enable test mode. And you want to exit your computer, and then you want to restart it, so I'll show you what happens after you restart it. OK. Um, so after the restart, you'll see a couple of quick things that changes. Your icons won't change like mine, if you notice that, if you have really good eyes, and I was just playing around before I started the video. And, um... Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Okay. So, you'll see this test mode, Windows 7, and then you'll have the build number of the program you, of the program you used. Okay, so what you want to go do is you want to go back to your device manager. This may make your computer run a little bit slower, so I'd suggest, like, not running it after you do it. Because look at my CPU right now. Yeah, that's bad. I don't know why it's up bad, actually. I have a pretty good thing, so. And see, your little icon's gone. I'm going to your action replay. And yep, there you go. No more spinning circles. 
Thank you for watching, people. If this has helped you in any way, shape, or form, please subscribe to our channel. We need your help. We need it. We need it. We need it. We want to continue our channel. I'm not really motivated to continue it if I don't get subscribers. I'm sorry, but it's just me. But uh, I will continue to do more awesome helps like this in the future. We, I'm sorry if you watched our last video. I did not get to the Minecraft series today. I will get to that straight thing tomorrow. I'm off for summer, so every single day should be a video. Thank you guys for watching so much. We love you. Have an awesome day. Have an awesome day.